These are the EB24 and EB24R electric bevelers. They're the perfect tool for creating bevels on heavy materials for weld preparation. Their design makes it easy to get excellent results extremely quickly. They're fully compatible with European Union CE, CB, and EMC standards. They use an AC induction motor for long life, low maintenance, even speed, low noise, and excellent torque. They have a relay type on-off switch for safety. If power is interrupted, the machine will not restart by itself when the power comes back on. You need to press the on button anew. The key to their speed and accuracy is the double row staggered milling head with 12 carbide inserts. The carbide inserts mill away the material at high speed, leaving an accurate edge, while the staggered design minimizes chatter. Each square insert is standard sized and has four usable faces. So when one face is worn, simply rotate each insert to the next unworn face. The ergonomic handles allow you to grip the tool in a variety of different positions as needed. The bevel angle adjusts to any angle up to a maximum of 60 degrees by rotating the table plate. The angle is shown on the scale. The chamfering height adjusts by turning the depth adjuster knob. There's a chamfer height scale. There are pads on the bottom of the motor, which make it convenient to place the machine while making adjustments. The model EB24 has angular adjustment from 15 to 60 degrees with a maximum land width of 21.9 millimeters at 45 degrees. The table plate rollers relieve sliding friction and support the weight of the machine for smooth operation. The EB24 comes complete with the two milling discs and 12 inserts installed, as well as M3 and M8 LHAX wrenches, M32 wrench, and M24 by M27 double open end wrench. The model EB24R has the additional functions of pipe beveling and zero degree facing off. It has angular adjustment from zero to 60 degrees and a maximum land width of 20 millimeters at 45 degrees and 21 millimeters at zero degrees. The zero degree angle allows facing off of the workpiece edge. All that's needed is to switch to the zero degree milling receiver. The bevel milling receiver is used for all other angles. The guide rollers are in their fixed position for plate beveling and facing off while they fit in these slots for pipe beveling. They are then adjusted to match the radius of the pipe. As standard equipment, the EB24R can bevel pipes from a diameter from about 150 millimeters up to 350 millimeters. If even larger pipes need to be beveled, we offer an optional large table plate for pipes from 300 to 600 millimeter diameters. The EB24R comes complete with the two milling discs and 12 inserts installed, as well as the zero degree milling receiver, M3 and M8 LHAX wrenches, M22 open end wrench, M32 wrench, and M24 by M27 double open end wrench. Both machines and their accessories all fit in the blow molded case. The case is equipped with wheels to make transport very convenient. Either machine is an excellent beveler for fast and reliable weld preparation. To work on a milling head, slacken the angular adjustment screws, loosen and remove both depth lock screws, then pull away the bracket head assembly. To rotate or replace the carbide inserts, use the M3 LHAX wrench. Note the orientation of the cutting face. The bevel of the insert should face away from the direction of rotation, which is clockwise. Push all the way in and tighten. To change the milling receiver on the EB24R, loosen the nut on the spindle. Then remove the washer, two milling discs, and the spacer between them. Remove the parallel key and finally the milling receiver itself. We'll install the zero degree milling receiver. It's marked with a zero. Parallel key.
When replacing the milling discs, make sure that they are staggered 90 degrees from each other with the inserts in the correct orientation, so they're, they're overlapping each other. Spacer. Okay. Now the washer. The washer has a convex face that should be facing out. And the nut. Tighten the nut. Replace the bracket head assembly and both duct lock screws. To adjust the bevel angle, loosen both angular adjustment screws. Adjust to the desired angle and tighten. To adjust the chamfering height, loosen both duct lock screws and turn the depth adjuster knob. Refer to the scale. Since the chamfering height changes whenever the bevel angle is changed, you need to first find the zero point. Turn the tool holder so that one of the inserts is at the highest point and use a straight edge. Turn the depth adjuster knob to get a baseline zero point. Compensate accordingly and adjust from there. Place the machine on the plate with a milling head not touching the workpiece. Start the machine by firmly and deliberately pressing the on button for one full second. A light, quick push could shorten the life of the switch. Set up the EB24R for pipe beveling. Use the M22 wrench to loosen each large roller assembly from its fixed beveling position. Place the wedge knot in the slot and screw on the roller assembly finger tight only. To switch to the optional large table plate, first remove the bracket head assembly and remove the angular adjustment screws. Lift away the inner cover and install it on the large table plate. With the chamfering height set to zero, place the machine on the pipe and match both rollers to the circumference of the pipe. Now tighten. Reset the chamfering height. 